Christmas time coming up now and time to be thinking about your Christmas dinner. For most people it's turkey on the menu. When you're looking for a turkey at Christmas time, you need to be looking for something which has a little bit of fat about it. That's why we go for the bronze free range. This is a slow growing, fully matured bird. With a fully matured bird, you get this natural layer of fat under the skin of the bird. This helps to keep the dense meat quite moist during cooking. When you're ordering your Christmas turkey, make sure you get enough to feed all the family. We recommend half a kilo per person in a whole bird. About 350 grams per person if it's a crown you're going to have, which is, a, which is the breast meat on the bone and the legs off and the back of the carcass off. If it's a turkey roast, we would recommend about 200 to 250 grams per person. If you're unsure about anything, about buying your turkey, where your turkey's coming from, what type of turkey and what size, just ask your local Q Guild butcher. I'm now going to show you how to prepare your turkey. And we'll need a roasting dish, first of all. And we're going to cook the bird breast side down. Now, the reason for this is because most of the fat in the turkey is on its back here. And this is going to help with the basting during the cooking. It's very simple. We're just going to put on a bit of, bit of salt and pepper on here. Salt. And we're going to add a couple of onions, a couple of chopped onions there. And a cup of water. And a cup of water will stop it from drying out. There's one extra thing we need in here. Most importantly, the giblets. Don't forget the giblets. The gizzard, the liver, the heart. Adding the giblets gives you that real depth of flavour in your gravy. No need for gravy granules. This is a four and a half kilo turkey, a 10 pound bird, probably the most common bird that we sell, the most common size. I would recommend cooking this at 165, 170 degrees for the first hour with the breast down. After cooking for an hour, we want to take the bird out and turn it back over to brown off the breast. I also recommend that you use one of two thermometers which are readily available from most butcher shops. Some bronze free range turkeys, you'll find that they come free. This is a pop-up type where we'll plunge this into the side of the breast, into the thickest part. When the bird's ready, you'll find that the red part will pop up. That should take about another hour and a half to cook. So a total cooking time for a bird of this weight in 10 pounds, four and a half kilos, should be about two and a half hours. This is the other type of thermometer we have here. Here, it's not a pop-up and it's a reusable one. This, we put this also, putting the tip into the deepest part of the muscle in the breast and keep an eye on the dial and it'll tell you when your dirk is ready. There again, it should be about another hour and a half, should be a total cooking time of about two and a half hours. So that's the turkey now ready to go. I'm just going to turn it back over the breast down and it's ready to go in the oven. 